What's going on everyone? It's Greg back with some more Mirror 4 and we're on the very last scroll of our current available mysteries. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. You're right on into it. Incomparable Master. We're on Celestial, Gorfine, Kang, Sherim. Clue number one. Beastly and Fairy Ox Talisman. What kind of man makes such a dangerous bet with a woman he can't even fight? I don't know. I don't know when I meet Wam. Must hurry, hurry up and go to Yi Wu. So I believe this is... This should be the back to the same one in the uh, trading post. Yeah, yep, right there. So we're gonna do our usual thing here and fly over there. All right, Yo, what you got for us? Clue number one. All right, what happened to Master Kane? Master Kane has been poisoned by demonic energy. Uh oh, we gotta help. Yeti Clops High Heart. I see that. All right, we need the Yeti Clops heart. Let's see what the next clue says. It says, I feel like you will play me. Uh, she didn't really introduce Wom, and she told me to go somewhere along the road to Pequa Stone Hall. I should ask people there for more information. So it looks like we actually need to go to the Spiritual Center. Um, let's see what this NPC is. There it is. I'm not even gonna try to say that one. We're gonna port straight there. All right, should give us our next clue. There we go. Welcome. Assume you've heard what happened, King Sherm. It's a powerful master before this. Poisoned by demonic energy. We need a Yeti Clops Captain's Heart. Okay. So next clue. In the Valley of the uh, Dead rules the Do Lord of Darkness, who has an immortal snake as his wife his treasure uh, I heard Wom likes bets but not riddles anyways I'm sure he's a, it's a demon so I have to get something from a demon and see Yeo Wuzhang hmm, I'll find out so for this next step we're gonna need to craft the Yeti Clops um, scroll so let's go see what we need all right so the Yeti Clops is uh, this bad boy right here Yeti Clops Captain Summoning Scroll Jeez. We need four of the Immortal Whitmore's Talisman. Now, of course, this is the Immortal Whitmore. Uh, I'm probably gonna go ahead and get a few of these. Let's see if I have anything in my warehouse. All right, so we now have the four Talisman that we need. So we can now craft the Yeti Clops. 100K, hopefully we get the item on the first boss because I can't go through this mess again. If I have to kill that steel bone so many more times, I'm going to be a little bit upset. So, now we need to head to the Cryptic Sanctuary. Right, as usual, we port into the stream fold to get over to the Cryptic Sanctuary. I'm going to fly over and hit the wall here. And go into our secret portal. Boom. And I'm hoping that I can solo this, but if not, we'll have to get some help and then finish it. But I believe we're going to go over here to the right. So you come out of the main entrance. It's not the first room, but then the next room. And let's see here. This should be it right here. And yeah, there we go. Well here we go
Here we go. We got the Yeti Clops heart. That's what we were looking for. Oh my gosh. Thank goodness. You know what? I'm going to see if anyone else wants to come up here and loot these just last two chests just to have a shot at getting one of these hearts. Oh man, that was quite a lot. All right, we'll move on to the next step. All right, so for our next step, we need to take this to the this dude in a snake pit so we came out of the cryptic sanctuary as usual because we cannot pour out of there and let's go to snake pit um and it's yeah here and then the dude's out here on this mountain i think so we just need to go to like that boss out there yeah there we go all right so we need to fly up there to that guy so we're going to climb up this mountain here and we should be able to fly across. And here we go. Now let's talk to this dude. There we go. Next clue. Uh, he got the Yeti Claps, Yeti Claps heart. Ended up getting two of those. Uh, no one took up my offer to try to give two of the chests away they could have probably looks like they could have looted one uh would have saved some time but that's okay um let's see got our next clue let's see what that is mystery oh i can feel it coming to towards an end and look our next clue just says clue x how wonderful how wonderful so for this we actually need to go back and talk to uh Kareem, Kareem, whatever his name is, in uh Red Moon Mountain. And so we're gonna, you know, of course, port to the fabulous ascetic. And per usual, we gotta go around this little mountain here. And can I run on this? Oops. Oh look, someone's down there. Oh no, 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 no. Don't fall off, don't fall off. Okay, let's go. Jeez, I really don't like the jumping mechanics in this game. But what can you do? So try to get used to it. Okay. Talk to this dude. Now we get our next clue. It's talking about the heart. Oh, we need a worship site access tag. So we need to take that to this dude. All right. So we're on. Clue number five. Wham! Ah, he slipped right away right in front of me. Have to chase him before he sneaks away with another trick. I'm sure he used air walk, but wait, there's no path? No, Wham has a knack for trickery. So I'm sure this is the right direction. He won't slip away this time. All right. So now we're going to port back to the craft master and take a look at the um, worship site access tag. All right, so for the access tag worship site, we need two of the Crimson Spectra Dusk Armado's heart. That's the one that you get from the different bosses in Secret Peak uh, 4F. I think I should still have some in the warehouse. All right, so I grabbed two of those out of my warehouse, and now we're going to craft the worship, sh worship site access tag. And now we actually need to go back to Kareem in, uh, not Snake Pit, in Red Moon mountain you know i'll we'll just go straight there all right so we're gonna talk to kareem and we get our next clue here's our man uh i forget who it is oh uh, uh okay let's just see what our next clue is a little too much talking for me so mystery clue number six i finally found him it feels like because i've been played with so much i forgot why i wanted to see wom in the first place oh that's wom okay well one thing's for sure let's fight oh so do we need to oh no that's not wom wom that's uh bring me a demonic spirit dragon's token so for the next clue we need to go craft another summoning scroll for the final boss of the mysteries well incomparable master until we get some more mysteries this is the final boss this is what everything has led up to at this point 
we go to craft this is what we're gonna need we need to craft this bad boy right here demonic spirit dragon summoning scroll you know of course I have my materials here which is actually probably good I have these materials because normally uh I'm using these on glitter and powder but uh, I do have some saved up and then we need four beastly nefariox talisman I'm getting so tired of fighting this guy um oh is this the beastly nefariox okay never mind it says you need to get the crypt sanctuary but it's not uh it's the same talisman that drops from this bad boy right here I have one of these on me so let me go ahead and make like three more and we will summon those so I have I don't think I have any talisman um, but I have one summoning scroll already so now I have four I'm gonna do this and we'll come back and make this and hit up that final boss alright so I collected everything I needed and I am now gonna craft this demonic spirit dragon summoning scroll alright per usual for this boss we're gonna need to go to the cryptic sanctuary So we're going to jump in there and we should have a new area unlocked where we can spawn this boss. Alright, so we're going to try to spawn the boss. This is a level 90 boss. I don't know if I can solo it. I do have someone here to try to help me, but I'm going to see if I can drag it back and see how this goes. Maybe this will be a strat for you, anyone who tries it. I don't know. If you're the first one on your server doing this, then uh, it could be a little bit difficult. Let's see how far back I can bring him. Um, hmm. Alright, so it looks like you can't bring it out to the hallway. I don't know how far. It looks like he will be able to assist me. It seems doable. Um, I probably could solo it inside if I need to. Uh, it's going to take a while. So, alright, we're going to do this fight. See how it goes. All right, so took down that boss. Um, not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Definitely not, not bad at all. Not level 90 or 91. Now I'm just hoping I actually get the item since all of my bad luck on the other ones. Um, man, I really, 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 really hope we do. That one, you know, that was a cool little boss. Um, you are able to pull it to the door if you want. Some people want to help you that can't get in yet. There we go. We got it. Thank you. 
All right, so once you got this item off of the boss, it is time to go back to Curring in uh, what you call it, uh, Red Moon Mountain, and I'll see you when we get there. All right, so I believe we actually talked to Doe here. Yeah, that's gonna give us our next clue. We're at six out of eight, almost there. All right, let's see here. What's our next clue say? Clue number seven, I never thought I could be neck and neck with Master Wom. Maybe I'm strong now, or maybe I'm very strong now. I should meet Yeo. Oh, Yeo again. I gather more information recluse and about other reclusive masters. I could see more if I'm lucky. Oh, we're almost there, I can taste it. Let's go talk to Yeo in, uh, whatchamacallit, Snake Pit, Center Shire, Trading Post. And hopefully, hopefully this is it. All right, let's see if it's at her normal spot. I might have to go somewhere else. Let's see here. Uh, normally over here. Oops. You know, okay. Did we talk to Yeo? No, we don't want to talk to Yeo. I think we got to go to another part of the map. Looks like we actually need to be over in this area. It should activate the next part of the quest. Let's see. Uh, do we see a green light anywhere? Hey, there it is. So where's it at? That's up in this area on the map. So we don't go straight to Yeo. We're going to come over here. And I think there's another little cutscene. Here we go. We got Kang Sharim. Who is this? Oh, we got a fight? Oh, yeah. The final countdown. Here we go. This is it. Come on now. I was called a celestial lord. All right, is that it? Are we now complete? Oh no, we're not complete. I'm sure Park Po at Cinnershire knows more about Master King Sharim. Finally, I'm gonna go see the Celestial Lord that Ma Master Bach talked about. It right, looks like now we actually do need to go talk to Yeo. Yeah, yeah, our little scroll popped up down here. So we are gonna go talk to Yeo. Yeo. Let's go. Whoop. I'm gonna do all kinds of flying here. And one last little flight. Maybe this is it. The end of the road. Until we get a new set of mystery quests. There we go, eight out of eight free from demonic energy we leave nonetheless thank you so much please have this it's called demonic jade marble purified demonic energy i went through some trouble i'm going to leave on journey two seek to protect the good i mustn't be afraid to get dirty to gain power oh okay oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah let's go here we go claim reward is this what the oh demonic jade marble okay this is what she's talking about boom Complete 200k, dark steel 200k, copper, thank you very much. This is complete now. Boom, 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 boom. That's pretty nice rewards right there. We can try to upgrade some epic stuff a little bit more. Got 10 uh, epic dragon statues. Three rare spirits, not bad. Why didn't you just give you four, make you, let you do a combine. That, that, that would've been nice. That's okay though. And what's next? Uh, now we claim our reward from here. And we're done until they add another mystery to the game. 
we got the box and three epic dragon statues let's see what's in our box here is this it uh yeah you used to get two epic mystic enhancement stones one epic dark stone and 300k dark steel we will take it thank you thank you there you go guys it was a long road we have finished finished incomparable master um hope you guys appreciated all of the guys if you did make sure you hit that like button if you're not subscribed yet go ahead and hit that subscribe button turn those notifications on and i'll catch you guys in the next video later